Hey, Lord, but you're right. It's good Welcome back for another video of Owl's Flipper. We're gonna continue this series. Now, if you guys hear some noise behind uh, me or something like that, some background noise. The temperature right now is super hot in my ha in my room, so I gotta cool it down a little bit, have a little bit of freshness into it. So, if you guys hear some noise, it's normal. It's only the, uh, my fan doing that, and uh, that should be do uh, that should be good. Aside from that, there's nothing else. Uh, we're gonna uh, go on and continue on our work over the city right here. We've got two different houses that we gotta choose from. So either this one or this one. I did say I wanted to do this one. So we're gonna move on to uh, this one for this one. So Water Horizon. Alice and Kevin bought a house by the road leading directly to the beach. It has three bedrooms and two bed uh, bathrooms. They always wanted to live in a peaceful place where they could raise their son. For this... Uh, b to be true, however, some renovations work need to be performed first. I'll see you there. So there's three choices to make and 11 rooms in total. That's a lot. If we close that down. If we go to the other one, which is this one, two choices, 14 rooms though. All right, well, we'll go and do this one. Why not? All right, let's check the house up, boys. So this is what we got to look at. Uh, first off, we're going to start working on the... the the corner and everything on what they have here on the outside, right? That's what we're going to look at right here. We're going to try to get rid of all these little things uh, that are out of control, really. All these little bad uh, bad types of grasses and, and stuff like that. They've got a lot going on, too, which is not too good. Uh, let's get rid of all of this. There we go. As many as possible. Now, I don't think I'm supposed to do this. But it helps out with the progress if I do it. So I'm obviously going to do it, boys. I don't know where this one is. I can't even see it, man. And some of these I can't I can't see for some reason. So I don't know. We can't just stop all of them, right? We can always uh, as well just uh, pass uh, past, uh, the thing and stuff like that. Go and uh, clean up the grass. And that could do it in its own right. But I don't know if I want to truly do that. I feel like that would be big time of wa waste of time for the video and stuff like that. It takes a long time to do these types of stuff. So yeah, I'm just going to do my thing, I guess. Continue to look for stuff like these. All around, boys. Look at all this. All this shit, man. It was, it's all growing up. Like It needs to be tre uh, treated uh, a little bit better. I gotta tell you on that part, that's for sure. Good lord, there's so many uh, bad stuff too. Look at this shit. Shit's ridiculous, boys. So, all right, yes, yeah, so let's continue on working on all of this. I think we're getting good right now. We, there's not too many stuff left. There is some uh, trees, but I don't think they want me to get rid of the trees per se. So I think that should be it. Uh, we just gotta enter the house now, so let's go take a look and see if we cannot uh, take a look at the house, I guess. And let's take a look at the house and see what uh, we got in uh, for us right now. So first off, let's clean it up, because obviously we're gonna have to uh, get rid of all these uh, these uh, t stains and stuff like that that we've got going on. There's a lot of stains everywhere, actually. There we go, and okay, so all the stains are out. First things first, we're gonna go into this room and decide what to do with this. We do have to destroy walls. So that's the first thing we're gonna need to do. Uh, do I need to sell this? No, okay, so first thing first, we're gonna make a decision in this room because before destroying the walls, I need to make sure what, uh, what we're uh, doing here. So we have a mixture of old and new furniture, furniture here. What should we do about it? Let's keep these vintage tables and incorporate them into the arrangement. Old furniture don't go well with the uh, modern design. Yeah, we should get rid of all this old stuff, boys. Let's uh, get rid of all of this. Old furniture. It is true that old furniture does not go well with uh, the modern design and everything. It really doesn't. So let's get rid of all of it. And basically get them all everything they want to get so let's just destroy these uh, walls they did want me to destroy these walls so 
we're gonna do it boys let's uh do it there we go and uh yeah finish the job really quick so they're clearing out some space obviously maybe for the kitchen right it clears out the space for the kitchen which is a good idea in itself now that's cleaned up uh remove the object showcase mary where is that at oh there it is there it is so that was the last one i i needed to do we do have to clean some windows so which one is that that we need to clean not entirely sure i mean they all look clean actually it's these two ones okay these are the two windows we need to clean so let's do it boys clean these windows really quick i feel like the house itself for the most part is probably going to be one of these that we don't really need to do too much paint or something like that maybe we will but i feel like it already looks perfect the colors and everything but if they want me to change the colors or something like that i will but don't feel like we need modify the rooms so build the upper walls okay so we need to build eight upper walls just like this so they they want me to build like this so upper walls obviously this is uh what they are talking about i think yeah that's what they are talking about so they want these upper walls uh we can do that i guess i'm not sure exactly what they are intend to do with this uh strategy but uh, I guess I'll follow them uh, really quick. I'll follow their lead, really. All right, all the walls are done. So this is what they wanted me to, to do. They wanted me to build a wall like that, several walls like that. So now we got to place a bunch of objects. Yeah, they don't need me to uh, repaint, which is already saving a lot of time. So let me get all these objects in. Kashi bright colored armchair, chest of drawers vein wall mounted tv name brother coffee table all this shit let's get it done boys i'll see you once it's all uh, purchased and uh got uh, got into the room and stuff like that all right there it is it's done the room is done boys just finished placing the last ingredient which was this painting right there this is what it looks like i decided to go all blue for the decorations and stuff like that now i don't know not a fan of all the plants and stuff like that especially the uh, maybe I, I put them in the wrong place and stuff like that, but it is what it is. We'll just uh, keep it like that. Right now, we're going to focus on the kitchen now. So modify walls. Lay wall tiles. White porcelain mosaic. So that's what uh, we need now. So white porcelain mosaic, uh, which is wall tiles. There we go. And that's what he wants. Now, I uh, think I'm going to go for still gray not uh, gonna go for stellar gray because uh it's gonna be it's gonna have to be silver glacier i believe or this is white is this white well i'm not sure i think it's i think it's white uh the color that they have i want to make sure to have the right color and everything so that's why i don't want to yeah this is the it was white so i didn't want to mess up the the whole system so yeah i'm going for the right uh, the same thing definitely gonna go for the same uh, tiles right the same uh, ones that they already had so that's how it's gonna look really just focusing on everything i did want to help it skip obviously the like the entire living room and stuff uh all the objects that i had to go through didn't take me a lot of time it, did, it took me maybe five minutes or so but i i just didn't want to bore you guys with it so that's why i did it right so there it is lay floor tiles white panels so we just need floor tiles now white panels uh, for the floor that's it right there and all the way like this and that's connected now boys so we need a set of orbs uh, of herbs shivs rosemary and parsley and also tim basil and organo okay so set of or herbs Basma, basil so shiv there we go this is the one they wanted we're also we're obviously gonna go for uh this small stuff uh, this one we're gonna just put it right there and for the other one it's see tim basil and orgamo same thing and we're also gonna put this one on the other opposite side right there if that's done the kitchen's done Pretty simple job so far. So we're done with these two rooms. We're going to head out to uh, this room right here. 
So what do they want me? This uh, nothing really. There's nothing to this room. All right. Well, let's go into this one. So this is the bathroom. Let's see what they want me to do with this one. Make a decision. So what should we do to the bathroom? Let's buy a large stylish sink. It will be useful for every member of the family. We also need to change the tiles, but it is not that important. Focusing on new tiles should be our top priority. We should invest in ones that will not only be beautiful, but also slip save uh, thanks to specific texture. We should think that too much about the sink. We don't okay, let's figure it out. They want a bigger sink. That's what they want. That means I would probably have to remove myself from certain objects here to make more space. I could do that. I think the sink is just fine as it is. Uh, but I like the color. So I don't want to put... Uh, no, I'm, I'm going to go for the sink right here. Hold on. There we go. Make, make the decision. We're going to go for the sink, boys. Alright, so... Standard cabinet. So we're going to remove this one. We're going to have to color some paint. Alright, so we're going to have to put some paint. Install cera uh, ceramic tiles, brown uh, 3D. That's what they want for the floor tiles. We're going to go ahead and equip that right away. It's the, the one thing that's the easiest to do right now. They want some walls to be painted and another set of 20 walls to get uh, installed, I guess. Pa uh, some panels and stuff like that. Let's take a look really quick. Brown 3D. What, did, what is that? Uh, brown 3D. Ceramic uh, tiles, brown 3D. That's for the floor, though. Yeah, I want for the f uh, the walls. There we go. That's I think that's my understanding that they want that, which is pretty weird. Not entirely sure what they want me to do with this. Maybe there's 20 walls in total I can do for both. Let's go with the ceramic first. All right, we're gonna do this first, and uh, we'll see how it goes. I guess. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, what it's gonna look like afterwards. It's gonna probably look really awful. I hope not at least, but uh, it could very much look uh, awful. I'm not entirely sure how it's gonna look, boys, so I guess we'll see. Is there still... Okay, so this is the mirror. It just reflects the other side, I guess. Like, this doesn't definitely not go with the color we already have. I like this color that we already had, though. That's why I didn't want to change it because I liked it already. But whatever, if the couple wants to absolutely change the colors of the walls and stuff, we'll do it, I guess. I just feel like it's a, wa a big waste of time, you know. There we go. We're going to just modify the walls. We're at um, how many walls now? We're at uh, 15. That's 16 walls. We're going to open. Can we open this thing? No, I, I don't think we can. Let's just, there we go, do that, I guess. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure which wall, so I'm going to go this side then. There we go. Just go on this side, and we're just going to need to focus on one more wall. All right, one more tile. Now, we're just going to focus first off on the, the other thing, which is white. So, basically, white color for the, the, the wall. That's what they want. Pretty simple color, I got to say. For bathroom, I, I really like the fact that they added, uh, they had the green color and stuff, make it a little bit different. So I like when the houses make it a little bit more different than just plain white and stuff. But it's a couple that gets to choose, I guess, boys. It's not me, so if I were to choose, it would be much different. But uh, it is what it is. Let's uh, go ahead and continue. I've got four more tiles. Hopefully, I got enough, so I don't have to buy more. Not just enough. Yeah, there we go. I had just enough. Good. Because I want it to at least work uh, work out perfectly. We do need to get the hanging sink Lamont. So that's the uh, the sink that they wanted. For the bathroom. There we go. Uh, which color should we choose? I'm thinking white could be uh, the proper one. There we go. Uh, let's just put it right there, I guess. And assemble all of it. There we go. Just assemble the entire sink. Just like that. It's a pretty um, complex one compared to the other ones. Some of the other ones that we could uh, do eventually, right? So, pretty complex. Go in before it floods the entire room, for Christ's sake. This is why I don't like doing sinks. It floods everything, every time. There we go. We got, we're almost done with this uh, sink right here. Let's put that in and it's done. Now we just have to clean that shit up. 
And there's the bathroom. Bathroom's complete, boys. I'm pretty sure we got plenty of other things to do because uh, we're done with all these rooms, or these little rooms. Is there something we are supposed to do right here? I mean, we're g we're done with these rooms. There's upstairs, obviously. There's an upstairs, so. Oh yeah, we're, we got a lot of rooms to do. All right, let's uh, start with this one. Yeah, let's start with this one, boys. It did say we had three decisions to make, though. Where would be the other decision? I'm not entirely sure. We'll just uh, do one room at a time. We'll start with this one. All right, first things first. We got to remove a bunch of objects in this room. Oh, shit. Second child, what is this? This was supposed to be an office, but it turns out that Alice is pregnant yet again. The couple is expecting a second child. They're considering whether to give up the office in exchange for a bedroom for a second child. Oh, so it wasn't uh, they, it wasn't planned at all. So shall we arrange this room as an office or a child's room? Well, first off, let me see. Is this room small? Uh, well, I guess yeah. It's it's uh it's big enough. It's big enough to uh, to have it as a, a child's room. Let's see what the husband has to say though. An office is very important to Kevin, who works from. He works from home though. The children can surely share a room. We can put a second bed there. Maybe you're right. He does need an office. After all, he does work from home. Uh, but two separate. I don't know. Children or office boys? No, children. Always children first, man. Children first before you. Obviously, so. Uh, paint with the color pink mist and white. Wow. All right, then. Let's uh, figure out what that color is. So pink mist right there. And they also want some white in there. So recently purchased white. There we go. So they want both of these colors. So nice set of two, uh, a big mix. So I'm thinking I'm going to do uh, pink mist right here and the white right there. So the white's going to be here. Oh, never mind then. The pink mist is going to be here. I pressed the wrong one uh, by accident, boys. I'm just going to invert it. Oh my god, stop doing that. What the fuck? Did the wrong thing twice, boys. All right, so let's just paint these room. Interesting choice. So it's a girl. It's not a boy. Definitely a girl if you're pa made it pink. Unless you want to torture the boy for the rest of his uh, early life. I'm, I'm just saying. Let's see what this is uh, going to look like. It's going to be an interesting choice of colors right here. Uh, it, it does fit, but I don't know. I wouldn't put that. Even for a girl, I wouldn't put that type of color. I mean, pink is a bit too much, I guess. Maybe it's just me, boys. I don't know. There we go. So that's that should be done. Pink mist is fine. Now we just need the color white. We'll, uh, we'll do what you want, buddy. Just put the walls to a color white right there. Let's go. Let's do it. We got a lot of rooms to do ahead of us right here. So uh, we got to make this quick. Oh shit. There's still more? Really? Okay, let's go. I think we're done. Yeah, all the walls are complete. Uh, colors are complete. Now we just got to put a bunch of things. So baby coat for a girl. Be, uh, baby co uh, cot for a girl. There we go. Uh, since it's all pink, let's let's put it pink, I guess, uh, on white. Pink on white, I guess, but just to fit the room then. And let's actually put like uh, put this like that. Cabinet granim uh, granimo. There we go, boys. So it was the cabinet they want. Uh, yeah, let's just put that there. Uh, Emmy rocking chair with patterns. Let's try that. Emmy rocking rocking chair so with patterns and this that's what they wanted dandelions rose floral and let's just put uh lightish or actually this that i don't like these these ones those those chairs they don't look like uh, uh i i don't i don't really like these these are the types of chairs i i never liked in real life boys rectangular carpet rectangular carpet oh, god damn every time it's too long of a word for me to write down boys what the hell carpet which one is that uh, dandelions i think that was the one they wanted 
So let's uh, put that there like this. Uh, dollhouse, a doll stroller. That looks a bit creepy, boys. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely uh, looks a bit creepy to my liking. Doll straw. You're gonna tell me you're gonna put some fucking dolls in here. Are you, are, what is this? That looks creepy as hell, man. What the fuck? It looks super creepy. Holy shit. And a ragdoll sue. Let's uh, figure it out. Ragdoll sue. Oh my, no. Alright, you've lost me there. Uh, this is just creepy. You don't get to put dolls into a house, man. I don't want dolls into my fucking house. That's not ever gonna happen. That's just creepy nonsense. Whatever, man. Let's just put into this. This one right here. This room. What is it now? Paint a bedroom. We've got to paint with this, uh, the color. Sunny yellow and white. So we got to... Okay, so this is the second room for the children they were talking about right here. So there's two separate... That's what they were talking about. I guess we could have spared it then. Ah, whatever, man. Uh, we've got... We're going to need to just change the colors, I guess. So sunny yellow and white. Sunny yellow. Right there. That's not going to be a good color, is it? Definitely not going to be a good color. I've, I, got, I already feel it, boys. But let's, uh, let's do it, I guess. Let's uh, paint these rooms, boys. These walls. Oof. Sunny yellow doesn't look good. What are they thinking when they're, uh, they're telling me... Uh, choose this color and this and that. Like, honestly, what kind of process are they going through when they're choosing the colors for the rooms? I really want to... I would really uh, be interested in talking to them about it because this is an interesting set of choice of colors that they're getting. That's for sure. Very interesting set of ch uh, of choice of colors. Uh, I'm not too sure what they're thinking about, boys. Oh God, not not white. Other color, my God. There we go. There we go. We're almost done with this uh, part of the wall right here. I hate the fact that I gotta paint through uh, fucking windows every time. Always got to paint through the windows, boys. It's ridiculous. This entire thing is ridiculous. I don't like this color at all. It's not even orange. Uh, it's not even yellow. It's more orange brown type of color. It really looks hideous. It does, boys. I'm sorry, but... I can't... I can't think of another word than hideous for this fucking room. Whatever. I'm not the one choosing the colors, I guess. If I were to choose, I... I mean, I would have put blue... Just put blue for the fucking guy, for the for your boy. You put pink for the girl, you don't put blue for the guy? Come on now. You put a fucking brownish color. Looks awful. Uh, Emi Light colored rocking uh, chair. So let's uh, find out what that is. This is probably the same type of cutting uh, thing. So Emi Light uh, colored rocking chair. I think that's the one they were talking about right here. Let's just do that, I guess. Right? Uh, I think, yeah, that's the that's the one. The, no, that's not the one. Which one is that? Did I not choose the right one? Uh, that's a dar dark one. We want uh, the light one. So, Emi rocking chair. Uh, light colored rocking chair. There we go. That's the one we wanted. And I guess we could go for this. Because this is the color they kind of went for right there. And to finish the job off, boys, nice little teddy bear. Look at this. We got a teddy bear in there. Delirious would be proud. All right. Let's finish with this room. We got uh, this room completed. We got three other rooms to complete in this video. Uh, actually, this one, we don't have anything to do. Perfect. So only two rooms then. We're starting to may run off of money. So hopefully we, will make, we can make good decisions. Modify the walls. So... They, they just want all the walls to be white or something? What's with the color? What's with white all of a sudden? Like, are, they're, it's like they're obsessed with that color for some reason, boys. I don't know what's going on here. They're truly obsessed with it, though. It looked already pretty much white, right? It was gray a little bit, a bit bluish gray, which was fine. But they decided to go for white completely instead. Like, I think they're just obsessed with, uh, with that color in particular, boys. That couple is pretty weird, to be honest. I think something went over their mind, or I don't know what they're thinking about. It's their money they're spending on some weird colors. Uh, I, mean, I guess it's not my money, but uh, that's just overly ridiculous. 
way too much white in every single room you're gonna have white like this is ridiculous modify the walls install wall panels uh, white por porcelain mosaic we need 15 of those and lay floor tiles so the floor tiles it needs to be light gray airing bone tiles there we go and now we just need to find a white porcelain mosaic which i believe is one of these things that we already had right uh white porcelain mosaic there it is that's the one boys uh, i'm just gonna go ahead and do this i'm not i uh, actually unless i want to uh sell that now unless i want to go for instead uh something else uh white there we go just go for the color and s uh, switch it up i guess okay so we got that i'm guessing that's what they want me to do right put it on this side uh, normally that's what they tend to do so let's just do it like that i guess put all the little tiles in there it's gonna be an interesting house after we're finished pretty boring one to be honest if they're just willing to do this like that like uh really simple walls like this uh colors set and wise i not sure if i would live in there that's for sure it's They've got a nice place and everything. They could like live up the living up of the house a little bit. I mean, they've got literally a, a view by the beach, just like the other one. And all they do with it is just put a bunch of random colors that don't really fit too well with the whole setup and everything. So I don't know about you guys, but uh, I don't. I feel like they really made the the wrong move right there. But uh, it's whatever. That's their choice, I guess. So there it is, boys. That's how it looks. There's the bathroom. The second bathroom, I should say. And last room. Last but not least, boys. Last, uh, last room. We got to remove some objects. Probably some pop-ups are going to happen. Remove this object. Double grill. So we just got to remove this. Okay, these two objects. This is going to be the bedroom. Uh, so we don't need to modify the walls, which is a good thing. We just need to add some objects in there so i'll just add the objects and we're going to be done with the job afterwards all right well there it is jobs complete boys uh just put the plant in here with some uh rows into the pink in there and we've got a nice little job for the house pretty simple jobs actually we got a, we had a lot of rooms to do but all the rooms as many rooms as we had to do it was all pretty much simple jobs not a lot of paintings to do it saved me a lot of time to not have to paint this room here, here right? Uh, the fact that they did choose to not paint this room, uh, repaint it, uh, that really saved me a lot of time. And I'm pretty happy with what I got. I still got a good amount of budget left to them. So uh, happy with what I got. Nice little cute house. Nice right beside the beach, which is right beside our house right there, as you can see. Now, it's not modified over there, but uh, for me... That's really cool. It's been modified. It if we go there, we it probably be the version that we did for the our uh, neighbors and stuff like that. So you can see two different houses really close to each other already done. Anyways, remember to leave a like. It's uh, oh, actually before I end the video, let's take a look at our job. Complete the job first. What well, was about to do the outro already? All right, well we're done, boys. We're done for today. We've completed uh, one of the the houses, right? Oh, we actually have another house that just uh, unlocked, which is this one. Right beside us again. Right beside the, the beach. I love doing those because we got the view and everything. So I might be tempted to just do this one afterwards. Uh, we got these two completed. These two completed. And that's not the one. That's five houses already completed. Uh, we're going to move on to a sixth one. This house right here actually will be really fun to do. This looks exactly like the house from uh, the Simpsons house. It looks exactly like the Simpsons house, boys. I wonder if it's exactly the same in the, uh, in the outs, uh, inside as well. But it really does. And it even has the pink car, boys. I think it's a, I think it's an Easter egg. It's probably an Easter egg. There's no way we can actually do this one. If we can do this one, that's fantastic because it looks, it's it's exactly the sp uh, the. Uh, Simpsons house right there. So that's really cool. If we can do this one, there's a maze right there. That would be cool to do. This entire uh, city, right, looks fantastic. 
it looks really fun to do uh, every single house looks like a fun thing to do so i'll see you guys for the next one uh remember to give a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video keep it easy